time for 10, week two. Right, so we're starting week two, back to the bench session again. Bench, pull-ups, dips. Today I'm up to 160 for four is my final working set. So just a, a slight progression from last week. Um, and yeah, we'll just keep gradually moving up as we go. So let's get started. Final set, final working set, 160 for four, and then on to the next thing. Oh, let's go. Right. Did it feel easier than last week? That felt easier than last week, and obviously it's more weight. Heavier, well, yeah. So it's good. Not too bad. Progress. Progress already. Okay, so session two, week two, um, just squatting today, working up to 210. Um, again, you know, slowly building up, first few weeks, nothing too crazy again. And um, yeah, I feel pretty sore. My hamstrings are still really sore from the hyper extensions I did in my final session of last week, um, deadlift session. So we did 100 reps of hyper extensions in as few sets as possible, so my hamstrings are pretty mullered, but, you know, just get through this. Again, that's another benefit of not going too crazy heavy at the moment, because I can increase the volume, and if I'm a little bit sore, it's not the end of the world. So then once my body adjusts to the volume, obviously, then I can start pushing the weights up. So, yeah, let's look forward to it. Okay, so final working set, 210, set of four. Um, nice and comfy, hopefully. Um, and then we're on the remaining deadlifts, Bulgarian split squats. Yeah, like I said, hamstrings are sore, so I'm feeling a little bit, a little bit tender. I'm having to be a little bit sort of gentle on the, on the way down, but yeah, it's all going all right, and I feel stronger than I did last week, which is the main thing.
they looked it. More like energy inside. That's good. It's a good sign. Progress. Progress already. Nice. All done. Bulgarian split squats now. Hate these. Again, um, we try and go a little bit heavier than last week. Um, went heavy on them. I did 50s last week, 70s this week. So I keep trying to push the weights up. I think I did 20s last week, 20 in each hand for the heavy set last time. So we'll, we'll go up a bit from there on them as well. Oh, what? Let's get it done. Strange, isn't it? Is it a balance thing? That's because that's my bad knee. Yeah. Um, maybe, haven't I? Got some weakness there. Yeah. But that's what we're trying to sort of Trying to get rid of the weaknesses, so they should get to a point where they're both the same, so I'll keep working towards it. But that was decent anyway, again, weight was up from last week and it felt easier, so made some good progress in a week already, which I'm pleased about. Just the cardio to finish. The goblet squats are a little bit different this week. Max reps in three minutes, rest as many times as I want. So get that done, get out of it. Okay, session three. Um, incline dumbbell press, standing log bar, uh, what else have I got to do? Lateral raises and some conditioning work afterwards. So we're going to push the weights up a bit. We're going to try to on the dumbbell press. Trouble is, it's a big jump from 50 kilos to 60 kilos. So I don't know with all the volume I'll be able to get the 60s for the full amount of reps, but we're going to try. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. Feeling a bit better this week. Not quite so sore as I was last week at this point. So it's looking more positive already and things are making improvements. Go. Come from up there. Boom. Be too easy to stop at eight. So that's ten kilos up from last week and two extra reps. So you're on the seventies next week. So that's good. Good progress. Okay, so this week we're gonna try and do 100 kilos. Obviously not big weights, my pressing's diabolical as most people know anyway. <laughs> um, last week we did 80 kilos, so big jump, 20 kilos, but hopefully I can do it. And um, yeah, we'll see how it goes.
still just weak, but up until about six reps, it felt good. So again, 20 kilos up from last week, so I'll take that for today. We've had some good progress already. Ooh, okay, session three all done. Thank you for watching everyone. Thanks for the comments. If you want to ask any questions about the program, why I do things I do, why I'm structuring it like this, please feel free. Excuse me, I'll make sure I answer them. And um, yeah, thanks for all the new subscribers as well. It's um, great to see the channel growing. And um, if you want to follow the same routine as I am, Head over to clubhsc.com. Okay, session four. So we've got today axle cleans, kettlebell swings, box jumps. So the axle cleans are meant to be 120 for six sets of three today. I did 115 last week. I think I'm probably going to crank it up to 125 just because it felt so comfortable last week. So 125 for six sets of three. The kettlebell swings are worked up to a heavy set of 40 kilo kettlebell. This week we're gonna try and go up a bit on that as well. So my final set, I've got a loadable kettlebell. So we'll try and ramp that up. I think it'll be about sort of 56 kilos, 66 kilos, somewhere in that range. Um, and then afterwards the box jumps. Last week was five on the minute every minute. This week it's seven on the minute every minute. So um, yeah, just some small increases from last week and just keep pushing on. Yeah, massive improvements already, which is good. Um, obviously, that's only going to get better week by week. So, two more weeks, I think, after this one, and I'll be properly back where I, where I need to be. Working sets now. First one is yeah. Well, they're all going to be 125 for sets of three, six sets in total. So, first one here we go. Let's go. Final set, six set of three. Um, yeah, it's all gone pretty well so far. Um, I feel a lot stronger than I did last week, which is good. So get this done and move on to the kettlebell swings. good felt pretty comfortable yeah pleased with that it was good okay box jumps so last week we went on to a lower box we're going on to a higher box this week eight sets last week we did five reps on the minute every minute this week it's going to be seven 
reps on the minute every minute for eight minutes. So eight sets of seven onto a higher box than last week. So hopefully we can get some improvement. Okay, so session done. It was a good one, big improvements from last week. Feel a lot stronger this week, which is good. Feel better conditioned as well, so made good progress already in a week, and um, well, nearly two weeks now, but I'm looking forward to next week, see what, what progress I can make. You know, it's gonna keep going up and up and up each week, so really pleased with how it's going so far. So, a session four done. Okay, so session five, week two. Deadlifts today, I'm meant to be doing, so last week I was meant to do 297 and a half for five. This week it's meant to be 300 for four as my final working set. I actually went to 300 last week and it felt really comfortable, so we're gonna push it up a little bit. I'm gonna go 310 for four as my, as my final working set. Yeah, then we're gonna move on to the other stuff afterwards. Um, all feels good, I feel a lot better this week than I did last week. Recovery's been better, um, feel a lot stronger, so already we're making good progress. So final session, hope you enjoy it and um, look forward to starting week three. set, top weight, 320, set of four. Um, yeah, we're ahead of the game, so let's keep pushing it while we can. Hit, um, yeah, I'm 20 kilos above what the program is, so good progress. Let's get it done, move on to the next thing. Oh. Oh. Let's go. Good enough, good enough. That okay. Yeah. Felt good? Yeah, it felt good actually. I can feel it starting to slide, but it's all right, I'm happy with that. So 20 kilos up on the program already, so good progress already. Yeah, I was wincing. I yeah. thought it was gonna be a disaster then. Yeah, it was a little bit nerve wracking. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so week two done. Big improvements this week. Feel a lot better. Recovery's been miles better. All the weights are up on absolutely everything. So next week we'll push on even more. 